Hello friends. In today's class, we are going to talk about the graphical representation of intermediate representation called as syntax tree. Welcome again and uh, the next uh, is our uh, syntax tree. Okay, so we have already seen the definition though I have written this definition one more time here that in syntax tree operators okay that is like uh, operator means plus multiplication that and keyword do not appear as leaves operator and keyword operator and the no another term is your keyword does not appear as leaves but rather associated with interior node that would be the parent of this leaves in the parse tree so they will become not uh, not appear as a leaf but it will be interior node okay it will be part of your interior node now another simplification uh, found in the syntax tree is that the chain of single production may be collapsed okay so if you have a like uh, for example in in part 3 we have a e derive t t derive f f derive id now we can collapse this entire entire this chain of single production so now syntax tree can be drawn very easily if uh, if uh, is a string uh, that is given to you and if you know the the associativity and precedence rule okay so if you are very much familiar with associativity and precedence then definitely we can draw this uh, this syntax tree now here you can see that there is a there, there is a bracket and that should be considered first so here uh, the bracket will be done first and then there is a minus operator b and c okay <clears throat> this is not a keyword this is operand and then there is another minus and then there is a b and c and finally both will be added together okay okay now so here uh, this is b minus c why i have done because they are in bracket then you have a plus multiplication plus and then multiplication so which will be done first so, uh, that multiplication is having higher precedence so now multiplication will come into the picture and multiplied by here in this case is a and this entire term is you know multiplied by the the keyword uh, the identifier is d so now this is how it will look like multiplication and then we have a plus so now we are done with this this part we have evaluated and this part we have done and then we have a 2 plus the so first it will be left associated the first this and this part will happen okay so first we'll do this a multiplied by b minus c this thing will do first okay so now here it will be a, a another node that is your plus and this will take the value from here and it will take the value from here and finally this plus will occur and that I can write it as uh, plus and I can take this node over here okay so now this is a complete uh, I don't need a parse tree uh, I don't need a uh, I don't need a grammar also to draw this syntax tree for it with the simple associativity and using associativity and precedence I have drawn this syntax tree now this is one form of one form of your intermediate representation okay this is one of the graphical form of intermediate representation now this tree can be visited okay this tree can be visited and the target code can be generated tree can be visited and we can and target code can be generated for it okay so like here if i want to say that i can say here subtract subtract b and c i can say and let me label it as a t1 and then i can say multiply multiply a and i can say t1 or if the result is in b i can say in b okay so this is one uh, one form of uh, intermediate representation and this form is known as the graphical form so this is a graphical form in which uh, the intermediate representation okay so that's all for this section thank you